Alyssa here, back at Bike Week. I've run into Jerry Palladino, and I've seen his safety videos, but I've never actually had the chance to see his show. I'm a dirt bike rider, so the thought of riding a big bike like this is a little bit intimidating. What do you think I could do about that? Well, you know, I teach the police motor officer techniques, and we prove using these three techniques, the size or strength of the rider has no bearing. Neither does the size of the motorcycle. Uh, in this show, you're going to see a brand new rider, just been riding two months that I trained. She weighs 96 pounds. She wheels this bike around like a toy. It's amazing. Two other very tiny women as well handle this bike as well as any motor officer. And you know, motor officers are the top 2% of riders in America. It's just because of the techniques that, that we teach and I teach in my video, and we're going to talk all about them in this show. I think you'll be absolutely amazed when you see what could be done with a little tiny girl on a great big motorcycle like this. Well, the truth is in the pudding. I'm very excited to see it, so let's check out the show. All right. you ever seen a cop ride a wonder how we're able to handle an 800-pound motorcycle with the ease of a child's toy? You came to the right place. We're going to show you exactly how it's done. Going to be using three simple techniques. These techniques are the exact opposite of your instincts, so you won't pick this up on your own. Somebody's going to show you exactly how it works. This young lady is Marianne Hamilton, flight attendant out of Miami, co-star Ride Like a Pro 5. She handles that bike just... Give her a hand, folks. Come on. We're on TV here. <laughs> Now, Marianne, I no, think that don't. if you put Tim on the back of your bike, Tim, you're what, about 200 pounds? She's about 112, 15, something like that. She is putting a kind of couple of pounds. Watch it, Jerry. All right, sorry. So you told me no one's going to see this, right? Well, it, it, other than being on TV, no. Come on, Buttercup. One right, for the sir, team. Are you we'll, we'll put one of those black things across your eyes, you know. That, and then you can go in the witness protection program. Yeah. All right, I'm ready. <laughs> Guys love this part, don't you? Cry right out loud. He's going to use those built-in handles. Why not? <laughs> Taking full advantage of it, aren't you? Let's see if it still can work here. Okay. Up. And turn your head. Look at that. Same thing. We still keep it a full lock turn. Folks, I've been riding about six years. If you can't do this with your wife on behind you, and you've been riding 20, 30 years, you're not having a fun ride. Let him get on his own bike. In the meantime, I'm going to introduce you to a young, another young lady. Her name is Stephanie Birdsos. This is her right here. She works in my office, and she said one day, I'd like to learn how to ride. I said, no problem. She said, no, I want to be so good I could actually be in your show. Prior to two months ago, this lady had never been on a motorcycle in her life. We took her from never having been on a bike in her life to being good enough to ride in this show. I thought I could do it in one day, 24 hours. It actually took only 18 hours. You can see the entire documentary on Speed TV. Just click on Bikes and Motor Man, and you'll see how we taught this young lady from a 250 bike into a Nightster and then to a full-size electric glide. Atta girl. Come on out here, hon. This is my wife, Donna. We're going to get everybody in here and play a little bit of follow the leader. One more time around, Steph. Pull them behind me. All right. Keep it nice and close this time. Now, how's that look, folks? I can't hear you. That's complete, total control of the motorcycle. Anybody can do it. it. Takes three or four hours to master these skills. They will change your riding life forever. Wow, that was absolutely phenomenal. That was some of the best handling I think I've ever seen. And these girls are all so tiny. Stephanie, you've only been riding for a very short amount of time. Yeah, I've been riding for two months now. I'm a brand new rider. Jerry taught me himself. I'm new to the show, so I can handle the motorcycle just like he can. That's absolutely awesome. Marianne, you're a real pro out there. How long have you been riding? I've been riding about six years, actually on the team now, riding for the Ride Like a Pro team for about three years now, and actually ride in the show. We put Tim behind me just to show size and strength that has nothing to do with riding. He's twice my height in size and weight, so we put him behind me and proved the fact that you can ride two up and still manage to handle a bike just like you can by yourself. Donna, you are incredible out there as well. What's it like to be on the road with Jerry and the Ride Like a Pro team? It's remarkable, especially when other guys see us riding. Uh, the three girls get out there and handle any one of these bikes just like a motor officer. That's what's really impressive, so it's great. That was an absolutely incredible performance by the whole Ride Like a Pro team. The ladies did a fantastic job showing how someone so small can handle just as big as a bike as the guys can. That really gave me the confidence to go out there and try to ride a big bike just like them. I hope you all enjoyed the show, too. Stay tuned for more from Bike Week.